Hello everyone and welcome to Fuchsia City. I am a Biting Gamer and this is a blind let's play of Pokemon Crystal. And for once it's daylight. Uh, in the last episode we defeated Erika back in Saffron City. And now we are in Fuchsia City where we will now explore. My grandpa is at my brother's bills on Cerulean City or something. I saw this weird slow Pokemon on Cycling Road. Are you talking about Grimer? I guess so. Because Grimer was pretty slow. I got quite a shock at the gym. There were all these girls who looked identical. Okay. I'm Jandine. Hocus Pocus. Poof. See? I look just like her now. I have no idea what you're talking about. Hey, you have a brand new kind of Pokedex. Did Professor Oak give that to you? Yeah, because I'm the best. I wonder how the Safari Warden is doing. Uh, and this- ooh, they've changed the uh, look here. There used to be a fishing guru here or something. My grandpa is a Safari Zone Warden. At least he was. He decided to go on a vacation and took off overseas all by himself. He quit running Safari Zone just like that. Does that mean he's dead? That's like when... You know the Pokemon have traveled to the... Farm upstates or something? Can we still catch the Sea Kings here? This is where I always caught my Sea King in my uh, in Generation One. Whenever I need one of the water Pokemon, I always caught a Sea King here. So just for good old times, let's see if they're still here. Uh, in this episode, I was hoping to either do the oops gym here in Fuchsia. I'm kind of curious to see who's the gym leader, considering we faced that uh, Koga guy in the Elite Four. Um. So I have no idea. Logic will dictate that it's probably... Okay, we give up. I'm messing up here. It's probably going to be Janine. That girl we just met a copy of inside a Pokemon uh, Center. If not, she wouldn't have a name and everything, so I guess it's her. One of the Elite Four used to be the leader of Fuchsia's gym. Yeah, I was just talking about him. Doop, boo -doop. Boo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, I also want to spend some time in the Safari Zone, because we... Desperately, uh, we're gonna caught and catch a new Pokemon there. I'm not really sure which yet, though. I'm hoping there's some new, exciting uh, second generation Pokemon in there. Because right now we have a Sandshrew in our party that we don't really need. I want to have something more exotic than a Sandshrew. But that, that's just me. Hey, wait, where is Sand? Ugh, come on. I deposited him? Why? I'm stupid, that's why. But there is also an area down here with some trainers that we didn't really get to. I think there's like a bird trainer here. This is usually where you can catch sparrows and pharaohs in Generation 1, and it still is. But we have a bird Pokemon, I'm quite happy with uh, my little Hoot Hoot, so we're not gonna bother. <laughs> oh, look at Skip Bloom or whatever his name is. Fight me! If you're looking for Pokemon, you have to look into tall grass. Wow, you could have been a trainer outside of Starter City, because that's a pretty pathetic uh, advice thing. You hear me, Bird Keeper Boris? Send out your Dodo all you want. I'm gonna kill it. And not with Skip Loom, though. We're useless, but... Uh... Yeah, definitely not. Let's see. Bird Pokemon. We don't really have anyone who can use... Um... Who can use... Electricity, so I guess we're just gonna go with Chikatita here now. Maybe try Sea Queen, actually. Water type should be like totally average, not weak, not strong, so should be fine. Hmm, I don't kind of want to catch a Dodo. I think they're pretty cool. Well, no, I have a water, no, a bird Pokemon, so never mind. Or, excuse me, a flying type Pokemon. Let's see. Sea Queen, I'm gonna give you a shot. You're about the same level as the end. Oh, you're actually much higher level now. Impressive, even. Huizong and Skiploom are actually the same level here, so I could have used them instead, but never mind. Ba da la da. Oh, one hit KO, actually. Nice. 
Show me your Dodrio. Yeah. Once again, I could have been a creator in this game because I can always tell what the enemy is going to do. I wonder what happens if one of those Dodrio heads die. Like, will the other two just live on and that one will just, like, rot away? That's kind of creepy. You're not the only one who can horn the enemy there, Dodrio. I can also use horn attacks and fury attacks. I probably won't be so lucky that it hit four times, but well, a horn attack only hits once anyway, but... Ouch! Critical hit. A lot of nice experience points for Sequins, so I'm pretty happy. Aye! Okay. At least we defeated that guy, just so you know, I remember to do that. I want to defeat all trainers. That's kind of like... Uh, must. You have to defeat all trainers. Wait, what's up here? There didn't used to be anything down here. Please be careful if you're swimming. Oh, wait, yeah, there used to be, but... There didn't used to be one of these buildings, right? Cinnabar's volcano erupted. It hurled boulders that cut off Route 19 indefinitely. I wonder if the people of Cinnabar are safe. Ooh, that's harsh. What if they're all dead? Ah, I don't like that. Well, let's go and withdraw um, our Sanctuary so we can cut down. And let's remember to change the Pokemon box too if we're going into the Safari Zone. Because we're going to catch all types of Pokemon in there. I just really like uh, all songs in Pokemon, actually, but uh, especially the songs that are the same from Generation 1. They're really cool. Bum, 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 bum. I'm really looking forward to seeing if there's any Generation 2 Pokemon now in the Safari Zone. I always liked the idea of the Safari Zone in Generation 1, but it was way too hard to catch, for an example, a Chansey. I have been able to, of course, but uh, it took a long while. Same with, like, Pinsir, and our Pinsir was actually kind of easy. Scyther and Chansey were, like, usually the hardest ones for me. The Safari Zone is- What? No! 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 The Safari Zone is closed! Why? Okay, we're gonna fish in one of the Sioux places thingies. Come on, why is it closed? Now I'm totally sad and I don't know what to do with my life anymore. I hate you. Stupid game. Better be something good in here. I was looking forward to the Safari Zone for so long. And I get a magic card poked. Police. Huh. Okay, but I have an idea though. I know there's like a mini game or like not mini game, but like mini quest where you have to catch the biggest magic carp you can find or something for one of those fishing brothers. Let's try the lure ball, which failed miserably. <laughs> I mean level twenty is pretty high level, so maybe we can like capture it and be like, hey, take a look at this, this is awesome. I'm so sad now, though. Why is the safari zone closed? Huh? What did the safari zone ever do to you? We're gonna have him poisoned, paralyzed, and asleep before we catch him. Maybe size isn't, uh, like, necessarily by level, though. Maybe you just have to capture as many Magikarp as possible. I don't know, but we're just gonna give it a shot with one high-level Magikarp. Should be fine. Okay, apparently Stun Spore just doesn't affect Magikarp. It's immune to being paralyzed. Repeat that when I break your neck, boy! Okay, I can't fall asleep either. Nice. Da, 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 da. 
Really? None of these powder things actually work on a Magikarp. Fine. Gonna use an Ultra Ball then, because he's running out of uh, HP soon. We're capturing a Magikarp with an Ultra Ball now, and that's pretty sad. You better be pretty big, Magikarp. Dum. We cut the poison, Magikarp. Okay, but whatever. Uh, but why is the Safari so close, though? Koga's daughter succeeded him as the gym leader after he joined the Elite Four. Uh, I don't remember who his daughter is. Was she actually mentioned? Oh, she was in the anime, maybe. I remember there was one episode where Psyduck went completely bananas and took down Team Rocket or something with, um... Ugh, I don't want a burnt berry. Come on. And I was so looking forward to the Safari Zone! There's not even a door here! The Warden is traveling abroad, therefore the Safari Zone is closed. That's so cheap. I hate you guys, I don't want to play this game ever again. And now I can't get anywhere, I have to fly back to... Fuchsia City. I guess we're gonna do the... The Pokemon Gym then. How annoying! I really wanted to capture like a lot of rare Pokemon. I'm so sad right now. I'm crying forever and ever. Uh, but the next step then is Travis going to Cinnabar Island and look at the volcano that's erupted there. Maybe that's like a new dungeon or something. I don't know. Um, but where is Blaine then? I kind of want Tiss Badge too, but whatever. Let's do this badge first. Yo, champion making! Oops, take a good look around you. The trainers all look like the leader Janine. Which of them is the real Janine? You are the real Janine. Fooled you! <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna take you down, lass. Linda. Linda lass. Oh, Bulbasaur, that's cute. Are we gonna give useless a shot here, considering pretty close in level and oh, probably not gonna be poisoned though, but whatever. That's not gonna damage us, right? See? And we have leftovers. We're totally gonna win this if we just... How are we gonna damage them, though? We have to poison them to damage them. Yeah, why can I be poisoned? He can't. That's super unfair. Oops, he is already paralyzed. What is that? Oh. Why does my powders never work, and their powders always do? I think that's so unfair. Ooh, sweet scent. That's so weird. Lower evasion. Okay. Fine, I give up. We're gonna change and coughing or something. This enemy Pokemon is useless anyway. Bulba crap. Ooh, I'm such a badass. He's never paralyzed either. Do you see that? He, like, never... Enemy is never paralyzed when I have paralyzed him. He just ignores paralysis for some reason. That's not effective against me, buddy! I fought. I'll show you what is effective, though. Sludge bomb! Pew! Stop! Be not being paralyzed. <laughs> You're supposed to be like totally dead. Or at least not moving. Sludge Bomb is a pretty powerful attack, actually. I like it. Wow, so little experience points here, too. Well, let me guess, we have an Ivysaur now. Yeah, and then you end up in a Venusaur. I'm gonna take them all down. The music here is so epic, though. It's like every bo or a battle is a boss fight, since the music is like super duper impressive. Boo! Ouch! It's a critical hit. Of course, it's race relief. Race relief always critical hits. Go ahead, you sweet scent as much as you want. It goes for Venusaur too, so Venusaur doesn't kill me. 
I don't like being killed, so... A lot of experience points, Seth. That's good. We're gonna let uh, Heesong take a shot at... Uh, Heesong! Take a shot at Venusaur, too. I'm actually a bit of a skeptic here, but... Uh, you know, you never know until you try. Dum dum. Are we going to use the full restore just to make him get all the experience points? Wow, that's going to take a while until Venusaur goes down. Ah, whatever, it's going to be worth it, I think. Full restore. Probably raises my affection with him too. Which is for some reason important. Don't critical hit me, buddy. Please, there's no point in. I guess I have to use Chiquitita in this boss or battle. Sorry, Weezong. Too crappy to win. Not my fault. Okay, at least I survived. Good. Bow. I really hate that low health uh, beep, 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 beep thing. It's really annoying. And now you use Sweet Scent. Of course you do. Finally, last Linda is down. Ooh, I lost. You're not weak. No, I'm strong, baby. Well, wasn't my disguise perfect? Sure, but I'm gonna assume that Janine is the one who's like stuck in the middle of all those mazes somewhere. I didn't really see... I saw one other Janine. I'm guessing that the Janine I'm looking for is in the middle of the maze. Just, uh, you know, that makes the most sense to me. Bow, 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 bow. Still so upset about the poke or safari zone. Why isn't the safari zone active anymore? That just makes me sad. That makes me a sad panda. Okay, let's see now. Next, Janine. Not up here. I hate these invisible walls. They're, you can totally see them. If they actually had been invisible, that would have been kind of cool, but they're not. And Janine. How do you know I was real? Let's battle! And you were revealed because you were way too conveniently placed in the, or in the gym. Ooh, a picnic or Cindy with only one Pokemon. That bodes well. A Nido Queen! Interesting! I guess she is a poison type, actually. Poison pin, just like Nidorina. Oops, that was the wrong move, but it doesn't really matter. It wasn't actually the wrong move, it was the wrong Pokemon. I was thinking that Useless would be the first one to be to get out here, but I changed the order, so... Which is good. <laughs> Darn it! I wanted to win! You must be getting tired. Uh, no. Hello, not Janine. Ooh, it's actually a guy. <laughs> you betcha, I'm Janine. Well, unless Janine underwent a sex, sex change, I don't think you are, buddy. Camper Barry! Barry is one of my favorite names in the whole wild world. I just always imagine there's like a really heavy set guy who speaks very darkly and his name is Barry. Yeah, that was random. Let's just body slam this uh, Nido King too, just like we did with Nido Queen. Booyah! One hit KO per usual. Chikitita is and will always be an awesome Pokemon. When we just got past Bugsy. My disguise was right on! Dang! Hey, you. Was my disguise cute or what, huh? It was actually pretty cute. If <laughs> So I'm gonna assume that you are Janine. No, you're Janine because you're turning so slowly. And you're not looking like at us right this way. So you're not Janine. Yeah. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> I was actually tricked. <laughs> yeah, you got me. <laughs> I was like, what's the point of dressing up if you're actually Janine? But you're saying that you're Janine, so you have to be Janine. But you weren't, were you, last Alice? Okay, you got me. Now you have to die. I'm gonna stick my foot so far into the gloom's mouth, he won't drool anymore. Okay, that's a bit too much. 
But last, Alice actually got me. I really thought there for a second that I had found Janine. And I was like, really? If she was placed in the middle of the gym here now, I just made a fool of myself? Aww. But I didn't. Ooh, an Arbok. I love Arbok. Once again, do you see that I have a huge preference for, like, uh, poison, grass, and water type Pokemon, apparently? That's like the three types I always use, it seems. I don't understand why. Chikatita levels up to level 64! I'm just guessing that we're never gonna learn any new moves with Chikatita. Another Gloom. Okay. Well, I have two feet, so why not? <laughs> gloom is kind of charming, though. Gloom is the favorite Pokemon of one of my childhood friends. Just random fact of the day. Defeated less Alice! I had you fooled. Yeah, once again, you actually did. Uh, good job. How will you distinguish our real leader? Well, I defeated everyone else here right now, so I guess there's only one choice. Hello, and you're not even challenging me when you see me, so you have to be Janine. Fufufufufu, <laughs> I'm sorry to disappoint you. I'm only joking! I'm the real deal! Janine of Fuchsia Gym, that's me! And no more talk is required to battle, apparently. That looks more like Koga's daughter than sister, if you ask me, but whatever. Ooh, a crow- oh, yeah, that's right! It has to be a evolution of Subat, like Subat has two evolutions or something now? I don't know. It has to be something like that. Because it's so similar in, like, shape and color and wings and everything. Not that- ooh, you survived one- oh, great. Thank you, Janine. You know just what to do to push my buttons. And of course, since I am confused and not the enemy, I will hurt myself in combat. And Wing Attack will be super effective against me because I'm a grass type Pokemon. Interesting. This battle just got harder than it needed to be. Well, one Pokemon down now, so hehehe. <laughs> Ooh, so left experience points, that's nice. Leader Janine is about to use a wheezing. I'm tempting to, or I'm tempted to use my own wheezing, but or coughing, but no. Wheezing. <laughs> Just body slam. It should be enough. Oh, it's probably gonna use self destruct. I'm not gonna struggle if it does. Oh, ta oh, that's super effective against me, isn't it? I keep forgetting that poison is super effective against uh, badly poisoned. I don't like the sound of that. What does that mean? Badly poisoned? I know that you got toxic from this place when you defeated Koga in Generation 1, but I don't remember actually what toxic actually does. I never learned it to anyone in Pokemon, I think. Another Weezing. No problem. I'll just body slam another one. Da -da. Bum -bum -bum. Let's see what badly poisoned this. It wasn't that bad. It was like 10 HP. Yawn. No challenge at all. Killing yet another Pokemon. We're not killing. We're not, never gonna kill a Pokemon. Injuring, though. Uh, incapacitating, I guess. Ludogene is about to use an A- Oh, that's the Spinarak evolution. No. I'm missing my Ariados, but I exchanged it with, uh, coughing. It just has to be that way. But Ariados is cute. Ariados! And I hate spiders in real life. I really do. But that one is cute. One Pokemon left our leader Janine. What are you going to do now? A Venomoth. Just like in the anime, as far as I remember. Venomoth! Well, when I'm off, take Body Slam! Ooh, one hit KO, there too. Great! The leader Janine is down. You're a tough one. You definitely won. Here's Soul Badge. Take it! You're so tough. I have a special gift. It's toxic, a powerful poison that steadily saps the victim's HP. 
Maybe I should learn toxic as enough poison powder on uh, useless. I'm going to really apply myself and improve my skills. I want to become better than both father and you. Oh, we can't get out here, can we? Is this poison like more uh, occurring more often than ordinary poison? Or is that just the way I see it right now and I'm just fantasizing? It might be. Okay, we have to think whether to go next though now, since the safari zone is closed for some stupid reason. Um, either south or east. South to the waters or east to to Lavender Town. Not sure if we can actually go that way though. Can we? I, I'm most unsure about going uh, east here, so let's try that first. I think that's gonna fail. You're working a Pokedex? That's really something. Don't give up. Okay, no like messages like, hey, you better give up because you can't go this way. Uh, all right, if you go this way, you get all the way up to that city. And just thinking out loud here, you get to that city, and then you can't really get any further because there's a Snorlax sleeping in the way, but that Snorlax was sleeping in front of the Diglett cave now, not in front of that corner place. So you know what? Let's actually try to go this way. Maybe we can catch a fire Pokemon. Hang on, I have to phone my mom. Also known as battling random 10-year-old stranger. Yeah, I don't get it, schoolboy. Kip. A wall turb, that's interesting, but it's not gonna save you unless you self-destruct. Um, then I'm gonna die. I wonder how Sludge or Poison does against uh, Iron or Steel-type Pokémon. Probably not very effective, but we're gonna give it a shot. Ooh, okay. That was actually pretty average, then. I like- oh god, here we go. Sorry, Huizong. Oh, you survived! Color me impressed! But you can't continue on battling now, we have to change you. Oh, sorry. Don't we? Ah, oh, we're gonna battle to death, to the death. Against Magnemite. Come on, be brave. What kind of schoolboy wants self-destructing Pokémon? Okay. That I'll take as a hint to switch out to Chiquitita. Ah, da, da, da. Ugh. Have I told you lately how much I hate confusion? No? And I'll tell you right now. I hate confusion because it always makes me hurt myself. Always. Sonic Boom! At least Chiquita can one-hit KO these guys without them self-destructing in our face. And Heezong is now level 31, only like 5 or 6 or 7 levels to go until you become a Weezing. Weezing! I'm not gonna bother with uh, having Chiquitita there from the start now, we're just gonna body slam away! Oh yeah! What's your last Pokemon? A Magnemite? Oh, a Magneton, okay. Impressive, my young schoolboy Kip. We're gonna body slam that Magneton too, I guess. Gonna self destruct? No, supersonic. That's good, I guess. It could be a lot worse. Do, 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 do. Bow. Okay, at least we defeated one trainer on this road. But I see we're closing in on a 30 minute mark, so I guess we're gonna have to cancel. What a sad episode! Now it's dark too! I miss the safari zone! I wanna go to the safari zone! I wanna go to the safari- I'm gonna be like a spoiled brat for the rest of the evening, just yelling that all the time. 
I want to go to the safari zone. I don't want to Cragsire. Cragsire suck. No, they don't, but I don't need it. It's a water type Pokemon. I don't want water type Pokemon. I want a fire type Pokemon. I want a Growlithe. Growlithe. <laughs> or I want a. F not a Cragsire, no. A ground type Pokemon, maybe. That's not Sanchiru. Or maybe a normal type Pokemon that's not. Can't es. <laughs> Did you see that? Can't escape. Wild Quagsire fled. It's like, no, you ain't gonna escape from me. I'm gonna escape from you, buddy. Oh, I'm so sorry. Let me... Oh, a Venomoth. That's uh, interesting. Well, bye-bye, we um, Sorry, I thought you were maybe... Oh, you're paralyzed. I didn't see that. Sorry, I forgot all about it. I'm sorry. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna use next Pokemon and maybe catch this Pokemon. Not for use, though, but just for having it. Sea Queen. Fury attack should be weak enough to catch it. Right? Oh, yeah, it's a good start. Leech Life is not Grass type, it's Poison type or Bug type, right? So it's not super effective. Yeah, good. Uh, let's see now. Waterfall should be pretty weak. Okay, never mind. Whatever, we're gonna have to continue this in the next episode. No point in murdering Pokemon here for no reason. I have been a Binding Gamer, and sorry for having you join me noticing or finding out that the Safari Zone is no, no longer in existence. I'm gonna find that Pokemon Safari Zone Warden, and I'm gonna crush his new teeth out and punch him into his stomach. I want my Safari Zone back! Okay, I'll see you in the next episode where hopefully we'll get to one town or another. I um, don't really know where to go right now. Oh, sorry. Hiccups. I don't really know where to go right now, so hopefully we'll figure that out. See you next time. Bye-bye.